More on the Dwight Howard case on episode 8. New episode out now. Um, This is the reason why I want Bravo to read it. He can give you his reporter voice, right? (laughs) Wait, hold on, hold on. Do not read it yet, sir. Do not read it yet. I just want to give a quick breakdown. Many of you do remember in our very, very first episode, Buns and Basketball, we discussed Dwight Howard's, uh, I guess, sexual... Sexcapades. Sex Sex Sexcapades. You know what I mean? Um, Savage. And we thought, you know, maybe some of it was embellished, some of it was exaggerated, but none of it was. Accurate. It was super accurate. To the point, point, you know what? It's to the point where I believe it was a miscommunication between Dwight Howard Mm, right, mm. because Dwight Howard's saying this is extortion. The other person saying, like, no, like, dude, you did things to me, and mm. you know what? <laughs> this is where, this is where, Not nice. This is where I let Bravo take over and read. I'm nervous. Read um, what what's on the ESPN website. Make sure y'all. Y'all Google Dwight Howard's okay. court documents, and it'll be the very first option. So, Bravo, if you will, just do you want to put it up on the screen? In my little city, man. You sure you want to? Okay, I mean, we can. I'm just going to read no it. Pictures, I can read it. Nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Oof, We're good. Hairline. <clears throat> All right. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. The headline reads. Dwight Howard denies sexual assault allegations, wants lawsuit dismissed by Baxter Holmes, ESPN senior writer, October 25th, 2023 at 1032 a.m. Former NWA, I'm doing too much wrestling. Former NBA star Dwight Howard has denied sexual assault and battery allegations filed against him earlier this year and asked the court to dismiss a civil lawsuit he is facing in Georgia. In court documents obtained by ESPN, Howard said Monday that he engaged in consensual, I'm sorry, he engaged in, quote, consensual sexual activity with, unquote, with a man named Stephen Harper during a July 2021 encounter at Howard's Georgia residence. Howard denied that he caused any injury to Harper, according to the filing. In the original complaint filed in July, Harper's lawyers said he and Howard first began corresponding over direct messages on Instagram in May 2021 with Harper initiating the exchange. Harper accused Howard of sexually assaulting him at Howard's home during the subsequent July 2021 encounter. Quote, we fully anticipate Mr. Howard to raise the issue of consent in his answer, unquote. Harper's attorney, Olga Ismailova, told ESPN, adding that Harper did not consent. Harper's complaint also accused Howard of intentional infliction of, oh, quote, intentional infliction of emotional distress, unquote, and false imprisonment. Howard's response denied those allegations. Quote, what was private consensual, what was a private consensual encounter was made public for profit. And Mr. Howard's attorneys, Justin Bailey, told ESPN, quote, the allegations against Mr. Howard are contested. Mr. Howard intends to present the truth. The truth is Mr. Howard blocked Mr. Harper on social media and then was confronted with two options, pay to protect his reputation or have a fabricated story made public. Despite being an easy target due to the subject matter and his status as a celebrity, Mr. Howard chose to trust in the justice system and will rely on all future court filings to speak for themselves, unquote. Wow. The complaint includes screenshots of alleged Instagram exchanges between Harper and Howard from 2021 of Harper's trip to Howard's residence on the night of the encounter. Harper went to the police a year later. According to July 2022 incident report from the Gwinnett County Police Department, which was obtained by ESPN, no charges were filed. This report was, oh, quote, sorry, quote, this report was made following Mr. Harper being blocked on social media, and after the first demand for payment was rejected, unquote, Bailey said. In Georgia, the statute of limitations for filing this type of civil lawsuit is two years from the date of incident. 
sounds like it's too late. Quote, we had some independent investigation to conduct and Mr. Harper had some private factors to consider. Unquote, Ismalova said, quote, before we are all felt ready to proceed with the lawsuit. Unquote. Howard, 37, last played in the NBA in 2021-22 with the Los Angeles Lakers. He's an eight-time All-Star and a three-time NBA Defensive Player of the Year. Um, so now... <clears throat> that was a lot to swallow. Ba-doom. 